Baroque's Wine in a Can, premium Australian wine in a new form. One clear opportunity is to grow the Australian wine market. It's pretty static, it's been static for 10 years. So there's no point in selling more Riesling, more Chardonnay to wine drinkers because there's no more of them. Australia's population of wine drinkers is not growing. And only 25% of Australians drink wine. So clearly the opportunity was in uh, looking outside the square and uh, I guess a company which has looked outside the square for seven years now has been Baroque's. We've always tried to have a wine from the can that doesn't need an analysis. It's just full up front wow factor and that's it. So really the product is an international product. It's an Australian invention. Vinsafe was born in Australia. Premium Australian wine that's going out to the marketplace to bring people on to RTDW, ready to drink wine, in the perfect size. That's what we're, we're aiming to achieve. The winemaking process for wine in a can is all important. Peter Scudamore Smith, Master of Wine, explains. They've done a lot of R&D, done a lot of testing, they've done a lot of testing with wine made naturally and I think that's really the key today that many, many more drinkers don't want the perception that wine is full of preservatives. And I guess so um, Australia has a natural advantage alongside New Zealand. Clean and green. After the grapes are carefully selected, crushing begins in April. Steve Barracks explains Baroque's traditional approach to winemaking. You know, we've, we've taught them to actually just go down to minim minimalistic, which is no, uh, or very little preservative, very little additives. Slow down the mechanism process, less, less screw time, less crunching, less maceration, less interference with the berry. Try and work with the wine, not against the wine is the, the, the crunch of the whole matter. And if you do that, the less you interfere with, with a, a, a wine or a grape, um, the less you have to worry about later on. One part of the seven stage license agreement is to apply patented and proprietary wine parameters in order to achieve a profile, structure and quality to ensure the product's stability and shelf life. Peter Scudamore Smith explains his role. Some of my responsibilities are in the blending of the wines uh, for wine in the can. Firstly, I listen to the brief. Intentionally, the owners have a, a vision, a goal, and an understanding of what uh, will constitute a very successful business, a very successful drink for buyers of the wine. And I'm essentially looking for wines which are impactful flavoursome. Drink now. So therefore the ageing process does not occur in a can. I think that's very, very important. Therefore the selection and blending of wines is very appropriate so that the wine delivers immediately. We're dealing with a very, very inert uh, receptacle and something has got uses which uh, a glass bottle doesn't. It doesn't produce uh, glass that can shatter. It's very easy to chill. It's very easy to, to compress. You can put it in your hip pocket. You can take it hiking. You can take it sky jumping. You name it. You can take it. So uh, it's again it's thinking outside the square and I think the future of Australian wine, particularly to, to sell a lot, lot more of the vineyards which are going to turn into grapes, which are going to turn into surpluses, which need to go somewhere, uh, need a home. And that's where I identify that uh, Baraks has a, a wonderful opportunity in the future, uh, both with um, other people using the technology and Baraks using the technology internationally. In a nutshell, we've built the product from ground up We've had seven years of research and development to establish its quality and its credentials. We've built that product 
with its wine construction, its can lining and its holding element. We've now patented that process called VinSafe. We're now internationally taking it out. We've had our patents accepted in several countries overseas. What we've done is our patents have gone into the wine producing countries, the global consuming countries and the new global consumers. We're patenting under the International Cooperation Treaty which allows us 115 countries to be patented in. We've achieved its quality, we've achieved market for the product. Uh, and now we have inquiries from countries overseas that wish to be able to convert their wine to go into a can so that it can go into their marketplaces. Baroque's Wines, shattering the tradition.